Let's make this simple and easy crock pot recipe using chicken, stovetop, and green beans. First, you'll need to add one can of cream of chicken soup to a bowl and around one cup of sour cream. You can add a little bit more if you prefer, but one cup is plenty. Next, you'll add one third cup of chicken broth and mix it all together, stir, 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 until it creates this kind of mixture fluff. The next thing you'll need to do is spray your crock pot with cooking spray and be sure and spray the sides. Add a little bit of sliced onion to the bottom of the crock pot along with the chicken. I had seven chicken tenders that I needed to use up. You can use chicken thighs, chicken breasts, chicken tenders, whatever you have. Next up is the seasonings. Now for this recipe, I use Jack Daniels chicken rub, garlic powder, onion powder, Italian seasoning, and a little bit of salt and pepper. But as always, use whatever seasonings you have on hand or what you like most. If you don't have the chicken rub seasoning, I highly suggest substituting that for paprika and it'll taste just great. Next, you'll need to finish adding the rest of your sliced onion on top of the chicken and add the chicken flavor stovetop on top of everything in the crock pot. And top it all off with the mixture you created beforehand with the chicken broth, sour cream, and cream and chicken soup. Spread it on top as evenly as possible, but it does not have to be perfect. Add your lid, and I like to cook this recipe at three and a half hours on high. Once it is cooked for three hours, I will remove the lid and add a little bit more chicken broth around the edges of the crock pot. Now, I also like to scoop around the edges with a spoon. That way, everything doesn't really get too crispy or burnt and add a little bit more chicken broth just to add, give it a little bit more juice. Next, add your lid and cook for the remaining 30 minutes on high. Once that cook time is up, you remove the lid and grab a can of green beans and add it on top. Now, I like to cook this for an additional 30 minutes on low or you could do high if you prefer and just let that kind of cook and get the green beans good and warm. And there you have it, a super simple and easy crock pot recipe that I at least make once every three weeks because it's so good and so simple. And easy crock pot recipes are my favorite things to do. Hope y'all enjoy.